morning my friend and welcome to today's devotion today i want to encourage you to see yourself as god sees you but how does god see you how does god see us oh god almighty let's go to the bible to find out how god sees us first peter chapter 2 verse 9 but ye are a chosen generation a royal priesthood and holy nation, a peculiar people, uh, that ye should show forth the praises of him who had called you out of darkness into his marvelous light. Praise God. So, my friend, God is seeing us as a royal priesthood. We are children of royalty. We are living, my friend, in a kingdom. Praise God. We are citizens. We are children of a king. Oh, glory to God. Praise God. The scripture said that we were created in his image and fashioned in his likeness. Praise God. So, we are children of God. Amen. How you see yourself is very important because God is viewing you from a perspective of importance and of royalty and God is looking at, at you as a peculiar people. You are not your own, my friend. You belong to a God who ruled the universe. He is in control of everything. He is your Abba Father and he sees you as royal royalty praise god some of us uh, we look down on ourselves we doubt ourselves we criticize our very own self oh god almighty but god is saying this morning to see yourself as god sees you just like how the scripture said that god sees you that's how you are to look at yourself because you are special my friend oh glory to god you are a man of class you're a woman of class and god is looking at you as his royalty royalty praise god he don't want you to look down on yourself and have low self-esteem and have doubt and have fear he want you my friend to look at yourself as royalty because that is exactly what you are he want to bless you he want to increase and enlarge your territory he want to remove every one of your doubts and praise god he want you to have confidence in him knowing that with christ in your vessel you can smile at every storm view yourself see yourself as god God sees you even today as you meditate on these words I pray that you will see yourself as God sees you and that you will not doubt yourself but you will understand that with Christ in the vessel you can smile at any storm and with Christ all things are possible and the fact that you are serving the true and living God praise God it means that you have the greatest help in your life praise God God's help he is with you and he's going to to help you my friend to reach your goal to fulfill your potential to overcome your struggles uh, praise God to to become more of what he called you to be he is your help he is present help in times of trouble and there is nothing that is too hard for him to do he will my friend come through for you but you have to believe it praise God it takes faith to believe as a matter of fact belief means faith in God amen so if you don't have faith you don't believe God oh glory to God and when we believe God it it, 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 it boosts our self-confidence and boosts our self-esteem and it, 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 it encourages us to believe in ourselves and to believe in God and to have confidence in ourselves and to have confidence in the promises of God praise God so my friend just have faith because faith my friend will elevate you to a place of belief and a place of, of, of self-esteem and a place where you can be more effective for kingdom work glory to God so my friend see yourself as God sees you you are royalty you are children of a king God is the king praise God and you are his children praise God he created you not in any other image but in his image and his likeness he fashioned you in his image to to think like him to be like him to have his character oh glory to God so my friend you are 
are gods. Children, you are royalty. You are a royal priesthood. You are a peculiar people. Praise God. You are the head and not the tail, my friend. You are blessed beyond measure. Your ways must bring God glory because he created you and fashioned you in his image and in his likeness. Praise God. So see yourself as God sees you. Not how other people view you or how you think other people see you, but you have to see yourself as what the Bible said. Praise God. God sees you as royalty. Praise God. And you have to see yourself as royalty, as special. Amen. Royal priesthood, peculiar people. You are a chosen generation. And God wants to bless your life. Praise God. But he wants you to get rid of your doubts and your fears. He wants you to get rid of unbelief. Amen. And believe him wholeheartedly and have faith in him that with him all things are possible. Amen. In Jesus' name, let us pray, my friend. Most righteous and our oh, Father, we glorify your name, God. We thank you this morning, God, for this devotion, for these people watching. Oh, glory to God. Every word that was said, God, I pray that somebody will get it, Jesus, today. I pray somebody's faith will be increased and somebody will see themselves in another light, God, in another sense, God. I pray that someone will see themselves as you see them, God, and help them, God Almighty, to understand, Jesus, that it is not what other people said about them, but what you said about them, what your word said about them, and your word said that we are royalty, we are royal priesthood, pra praise God, and peculiar people. Help us, God, to look on ourselves, God, as you look on us, God, and to elevate ourselves and to serve you wholeheartedly and walk before you with a perfect heart. Help us, God Almighty, for the devil is nothing but a liar. When he comes with his suggestions, help us, God, to cast down all those vain imagination and all those suggestions of the devil and to uplift ourselves in God, to feast upon your word so we can have knowledge, God Almighty, of the truth of what you said about us. For God Almighty, your word is true. Your word shall stand, oh God, above every other word because there is none to compare to you. You are the mighty God of heaven and earth and we want to see ourselves as you see us. Praise God. Help us not to doubt, not to fear, not to worry, God Almighty, but to trust. Hallelujah to God, to trust you and to have faith in you, knowing that with you, God, all things are possible. Thank you, God Almighty, for hearing and for answering these prayers. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Amen. God bless you, my friend. These are the two videos YouTube think you should watch next, so go and check them out. I'm sure they will bless you. And remember to like, comment, and share these videos to bless others. In Jesus' name, see yourself as God see you. Amen. Be blessed, my friends.